So I'll come into your backs on the mat. Begin to deep breathe, wiggling out your legs, flattening out your back, flat spine against the mat. Inhaling through your nose and exhaling through that straw. Begin to feel that breath deep in your throat. giving your muscles lots of oxygen, getting ready to move. Stretching out, reaching with your fingers, pointing your toes, reaching, opening that spine, and then relaxing. Bringing your knees up to 90 degrees, hands out to the side into a T, drop your knees to the right, your head to the left, twisting, keeping that left shoulder on the mat, holding your knees slightly above the ground, contracting your stomach, and pulling them up on the exhale. Inhale to the left. Exhale up. Slowly twisting out that spine, warming it up, making it gentle. We don't want to hurt our back today. This time bring your right hand to the outside of your left knee and gently pull your knees all the way to the ground if you can get there. Exhaling when you get to the bottom. Releasing the muscles, feeling the tension release. Keep breathing in and out. Now inhaling back up. Exhaling to the left. Pushing that sh right shoulder into the mat. Twisting your abdomen, stretching it out. Nice and easy stretch here. Don't strain yourself too much. We're just going to ease into this. And bringing your knees back up. Hugging your knees, pulling them into your chest. Dropping your head to the mat. Exhaling, releasing your hip flexors, flattening out your spine, releasing your left knee straight and down to the mat, right knee is pulled slightly out and then into the armpit and hold it. Flexing your left foot, pointing your toes straight up, straight leg, contracting your leg. And releasing your right leg to the mat, pulling your left leg out to the side and up to your armpit, pinching, straightening out your right leg, lifting your heel off the mat, straight leg. And hold it, squeezing it tight, feeling that pinch. And releasing that leg to the mat. Bringing your arms above your head, stretching again, pointing your toes, reaching with your hands, opening one last good stretch before we start to sit up. You can come up however you like. You can, you can turn over to the left and push yourself up or use your stomach and pull yourself to a seated position. Now coming up on your toes, coming to the head of your mat, we're going to flatten your hands out in front of you and slowly begin to straighten your legs as far as you can, keeping that back flat. Don't compromise your back. Stopping as soon as your back starts to arch. And exhale. 
Inhale through your nose deep. Exhale, straighten your legs a little more. Inhale deep. Exhale, straighten. On your next inhale, reverse swan all the way to high mountain. And begin to arch slowly as you touch your hands together. Exhale, hands to heart center. Inhale, release, high mountain. Stretching, reaching to the sky, arching. And swan dive. Chest first, and then your head follows. Inhale, monkey. Lengthening. Exhale, releasing. Step or jump back into plank. Chaturanga. Upward facing dog. Up on your toes. Hips are off the mat. If you like. Inhale. Exhale, pulling your stomach in. Up on your toes. Down dog. Pull that stomach in deeply, all the way to the spine. Inhale, exhale, sinking your shoulders, straightening your legs, walking your legs out a bit. Inhaling and exhaling, coming up on your toes, looking forward, bending your knees slightly, jumping forward, floating, monkey. Exhale, standing forward bend. Inhale, reverse swan. High mountain, arching. Exhale, swan dive, chest first. And then your head follows. Inhale, monkey. Exhale, step or jump back. Vinyasa. Exhale, pulling your belly in, using your stomach to pull yourself up into down dog. Coming up on your toes, looking forward, jumping forward, monkey, exhale, standing forward, bend, inhale, reverse swan, exhale, swan dive, begin to speed it up a little bit, monkey, exhale, jump back, chaturanga, upward facing dog, exhale, downward facing dog, up on your toes, Look forward and jump. Float your knees forward. Monkey, exhale. Reverse swan. Exhaling your left leg back. Dropping your knee to the mat, flattening out your back foot to crescent. Pushing your hip forward. Reaching up with your hands, looking up. Inhale. As you exhale, begin to arch back. Pushing your hip forward and releasing to the mat. Right leg is back and all the way up to three-legged down dog. Keeping those hips parallel, shoulders deep into the mat, reaching. And swinging that right leg forward. Runner's lunge. Lifting your body with your legs so your fingertips are just barely touching the mat. Flattening out your back. Finding that good posture. Hands flat on the mat. Right leg is back up into three-legged down dog. Bending your knee and opening up your hip. Flipping over, if you wish. Reaching and arching, stretching out the side of your body. And coming back over to three-legged down dog. Swinging forward into high crescent. Arms are up. Inhale, exhale, sink. Bringing your hands back, clasping them together, opening your chest, and sinking forward. Hands are up. Stomach is pulled in. Breathing. Sinking. Sinking. 
and releasing your hands to the mat, walking forward to the center. Finding that comfortable position, grabbing your ankles, flat back, and then begin to pull. Resting your head on the mat if you wish. Breathing, inhale, exhale. Don't hyperextend your knees here. Keep that slight bend, pulling your kneecaps up. You want to protect your knees. Placing your hands shoulder width apart, spreading your fingers wide. And now step your left leg to the right side to join your right leg. Coming up on your arms into side crow. You can take this as far as you like. You can straighten out your legs. Or just test your balance. And releasing to the front of your mat, standing forward bend. Inhale, reverse swan. High mountain. Exhale, down dog. Inhale, monkey. Exhale, step or jump back. Chaturanga. Up dog. Exhale, down dog. Bring your left leg up in the air. And swinging it forward to low crescent. Arms up, fingertips touching, pushing your hips forward. Hips are parallel, looking up. Inhale, exhale, begin to arch back. And bringing your hands back to the mat. Left leg is back to three-legged down dog. <coughs> and swinging it forward to runner's lunge. Fingertips are just barely touching the mat. Back leg is straight. And releasing back, left leg up. Opening that hip and flipping over if you like. And releasing back to three-legged down dog. Into crescent. Hands are up. Inhale, exhale, sink. Bring your arms behind you, opening your chest and pulling forward and up. Pulling your stomach in, sinking your hips and breathing. Inhale and exhale. And releasing your hands to the mat, walking center, grabbing your ankles and slightly pulling. Inhaling and exhaling, protecting your knees by flexing your legs and pulling that kneecap up. Back is flat. Now bringing your hands to the center of the mat, spread your fingers, find that broad base in your hands, bringing your right leg to the left side, to side crow. And releasing when you're ready to the front of your mat, standing forward bend. Inhale, reverse swan, high mountain. Exhale, hands to heart center. Now we're going to repeat that sequence two more times, once on each side. And I'm going to speed it up. Get your heart rate going a little bit. Inhale. Exhale, swan dive. Monkey. Exhale, step or jump back. Chaturanga. Inhale. Exhale, down dog. Right leg is up. Swinging it forward, low crescent, arching back, exhale, releasing, right leg is up, 
opening that hip, flipping the dog, and releasing back, swinging that leg forward, high crescent, opening your chest, sinking your head forward, arms are up, inhale, exhale, pulling that belly in, releasing the hands to the mat, coming to the center, grabbing your ankles, pulling, exhale, inhale, lengthen your back, exhale, pull, hands to the center, left leg to the right side, side crow, and releasing to the front of the mat, standing forward, bend, exhale, inhale, reverse swan, exhale, swan dive, Monkey, exhale, step or jump back, chaturanga. Inhale, exhale, down dog. Left leg is up. Opening the hip, flipping over. And coming back. Swinging that leg forward. Low crescent. Exhale, releasing to the mat, high crescent. Opening your chest, dropping your head. Pull your belly in, sink your hips. Releasing to the mat, coming to the center, hands are in the middle, right leg is to the left, side crow. Standing forward, bend. Inhale, reverse. Exhale, swan dive. Monkey. Step or jump back. Chaturanga. Up dog. Exhale, down dog. Up on your toes, stepping, jumping forward. Inhale. Lightning bolt. Inhale, tabletop. Exhale, standing forward, bend. Inhale, monkey. Exhale, step or jump back. Chaturanga. Up dog. Exhale, down dog. Up on your toes, looking forward. Reverse swan. Exhale, lightning bolt. Inhale, tabletop. Exhale, release. Inhale, monkey. Exhale, step or jump back. Chaturanga. Up dog. Going back into three-legged down dog. Inhale. And exhale. Swinging that right leg forward to the outside of your right hand. Wide runner's lunge. Inhale, your left arm up. Up on your back toes, sinking your hips, looking up, opening your chest. Dropping that hand, reversing it, sinking those hips. Releasing that hand to the mat, right leg is back, side plank, left arm is up, hips are up. Take this one where you want. It can be down here in the kickstand. Chest is open. Or you can release your leg straight out. Ouch. Or you can grab your foot and open up. When you're re ready, release back to plank. Vinyasa. Up dog. Exhaling down dog. Your right leg up in the air. Swinging it forward to pigeon. Arching. Sinking your hips. Coming forward on your elbows. Releasing all the way to the mat. One inhale. Exhale, deep 
releasing, make it good. Inhale. One more exhale, pulling your belly in. And coming back up, pushing your body up, arching, grabbing your back leg. If you can, reaching forward, staying here. If you want more, bring that foot into your elbow. You can stay here. If you want more, reach back for your hand. Opening your chest here, looking up in the sky, trying to get your head back to your foot. And releasing to plank. Chaturanga. Up dog. Exhaling down dog. Up on your toes. Floating forward. Monkey. Exhale down dog. Inhale reverse. Exhale lightning bolt. Tabletop. Exhale. Inhale, monkey. Step or jump back. Chaturanga, up dog. Arching. Exhaling, down dog. Up on your toes. Exhaling forward, monkey. Exhale. Reverse swan. Arching slightly. Exhale, lightning bolt. Pull your belly in. Tap your feet. Tabletop. Exhale. Inhale, monkey. Lengthening your back. Step or jump back. Chaturanga. Up dog. Exhale. Down dog. Take a couple breaths here. I'm going to get a drink. We're going to do a short warrior sequence. <clears throat> Find your best down dog you've got. Lift your toes. Sink your heels. Sink your shoulders. Make those nice, strong shoulders. Now bringing your right foot slightly in front of your left, angling it out 90 degrees, stepping forward with your left, warrior one. Just a little variation there. Sinking your hips. I'm going to move back on my mat for this one. Finding that comfort. Inhale. Exhale, sink. Inhale, warrior two. Exhale, sink. Inhale, warrior three. Inhale, exhale, half moon. Left leg is down, right leg is up, right arm, excuse me. Right leg is straight, like you're pushing against the wall. You're not pointing your toes in this one. Pulling your abdomen in, focusing and breathing. And reach back, grab your right leg, opening up. Pulling and lifting and releasing right hand to the mat. Left hand is up. Reverse half moon. If you want more, you can reach back to your leg and lift. And dropping that hand into standing split, reaching up with the left, with the right leg. Straight. Grab your ankle if you wish and pull it in. Don't overextend, hyperextend your knee here. And reverse, dropping back to warrior two. 
tipping forward, reverse. Testing yourself and dropping that right hand, sinking your hips, looking up. And straightening out that front leg, reverse triangle. Arching a little deeper. And coming forward, reaching with your left hand as far as you can. And then sinking forward. Your hand can be up on your shin, fingertips on the mat, or flatten your hand, front or back, whatever you wish. Looking up like you're between two panes of glass. Now dropping your right hand to the mat, and left hand is up, reverse triangle. Still between those two panes of glass, pulling your belly in, reaching. I'm dropping the hand to the mat, left leg is back to down dog. Inhale on, up on your toes, looking forward, floating. <laughs> Exhale, standing forward bend. Inhale, reverse swan. Exhale, sinking. Inhale, tabletop. And exhale. Inhale, monkey. Exhale, step or jump back. Chaturanga. Up dog. Exhale, down dog. Okay, take a couple deep breaths in down dog here. Inhale, and exhale. Inhale, up on your toes. Step or jump forward. Exhale. Inhale, all the way up. Exhale, sinking. Inhale, tabletop. Exhale. Inhale, monkey. Exhale, step back. Chaturanga. Up dog. Exhale, down dog. Bring your left leg up in the air, reaching. And bringing it forward to runner's lunge. Outside of your left hand, stepping wide, sinking your hips, straightening out your back leg, pulling your belly in. Inhale, exhale, sink. Keep breathing. Now dropping your back heel, opening up to the side. Right arm is up, sinking your hips. And up on your back toe, twisting to the other side. Left hand is up, sinking your hips. Inhale and exhale. And dropping your hand, left leg is back, side plank. Take this where you want, to the kick stand. But always remember you're pulling your hips up, pulling that stomach in, testing your abs. Lifting your leg if you want, or reaching for your toes. And releasing back into plank, vinyasa, up dog. Inhale, exhale, coming forward into pigeon, left leg is bent, right leg is back, hips are flat and parallel. Exhale, coming forward on your elbows. And all the way to the mat. Breathing and releasing that tension. I like to pretend like I'm falling asleep in this position. To 
get as totally relaxed as possible. With each inhale, concentrate on blowing that tension out with your exhale. One more inhale and exhale. On your next inhale, come up. Sink your hips back a little more, bending that right leg and reaching. You can balance with your left arm forward, or you can pull that right leg in slightly more and hook it with your elbow and reach back. Keep breathing here, inhale, and exhale, releasing that hip. This is an intense stretch. Don't overdo it. Slowly releasing out of it. Come into plank to three-legged down dog. Right leg is up. Swinging that leg forward to the outside of, your, of the right hand. Left arm is up. And left hand is down, right arm is up, reversing. Sinking those hips, pulling your belly in, straightening that back leg, releasing the hand to the mat, right leg is back, side plank. Hips are up, reaching and looking up, lifting your leg. If you want, you can grab your toes. Releasing, arching open. Deep stretch in that left side. Coming into plank. Chaturanga. Up dog. Exhale, down dog. Left leg is up in the air. Reaching. Pointing that toe. Making it the best three-legged down dog you can. And swinging it forward outside of your left hand. Reaching up with your right hand. You can drop your heel if you like or test your balance and keep it up. Reaching, opening that chest, looking up. And dropping that hand, reversing it. Sinking your hips, keeping that back leg straight. Inhale and exhale. Inhale. Exhale, releasing to the mat. Left leg is back, coming into side plank, reaching up, pulling up your hips, taking this where you want it. And a deep arch on the right side. Keep breathing. Back to plank. Pull your belly in. Chaturanga. Up dog. Inhale. Exhale, down dog. Coming up on your toes, looking forward. Reverse swan. Exhale, swan dive. Monkey. Step or jump back. Chaturanga. Up dog. Exhaling down dog. Coming up on your toes. Look forward. <sighs> Inhale. Exhale swan dive. Inhale. Exhale down dog. And right leg is forward. Warrior two. Inhale. Exhale, sink. I gotta move back again. Warrior one. Inhale. Exhale, sink. Coming into warrior three.
micro bend in the knee and dropping into half moon opening your chest reaching kicking that wall legs are strong pulling it into your abdomen and when you're ready look up if you want more you can grab your right your left leg and lift and releasing reverse half moon if you want more grab your leg and lift release to standing split left leg is up Releasing back into warrior two. Tipping forward, releasing back, reverse warrior. Arching, looking up. Straightening out that front leg, arching a little more. Testing your balance by dropping that left hand. Tipping forward, reaching with your right hand as far as you can. Dropping into triangle. But we're not dropping or falling here. We're sinking, holding our stomach strong, letting it hold our body. When your hand is resting on the mat, it's just resting. You should easily be able to lift your body with your stomach. Left hand to the mat, reverse triangle. And dropping that hand to the mat, right leg is back to down dog. Now we're going to play around with a couple of headstands here, so if you can find a wall, or if you're confident to do them by yourself, I'm going to do them with the wall. Inhale, high mountain. Exhale, swan dive. Inhale, monkey. And releasing hands to the ground. Spreading your fingers wide, opening your legs slightly, finding that strength. Inhale, and when you're ready, push your legs up to a handstand. You're pushing up out of your body, your shoulders are not sinking. When you're ready, look for that balance. Test yourself. Release the wall. And when you're ready, come into child's pose on your mat. We don't want to bring our head up too quickly after doing handstands. It's got a lot of blood. Blood flow straight to your head. Okay, now we're going to try a little bit more difficult one. Bringing your hands flat on the ground, elbows to hands. Coming up into dolphin. And just play around with this one. You can stay in dolphin if you want, or you can try kicking your legs up. And slowly bring your head forward, looking forward at your hands. Mm. 
and coming into child's pose when you're done. And we'll do one more in a headstand. This time bringing your head in front of your hands. Your hands are out 90 degrees. Or you can bring your hands and clasp your fingers behind your head. And slowly walk up. And reaching up into headstand. You can play around here if you want. I'm going to attempt half lotus and then full lotus. <laughs> okay, back into child's pose. When you're ready, And now is a time, good time to get a drink. And we're going to meet back on our mat with our backs flat. We're going to do some core work here. Releasing your head down. Knees are up at 90 degrees. Bring your legs all the way up. Grabbing your toes, just like standing forward bend, but on your back. Inhale. On your exhale, begin to pull your legs wide, pulling them all the way to the floor as far as you can. Grabbing your ankles and pulling a little bit more. Opening your hips. Inhale your hands up. And exhale, begin to come up and crunch. Pulling your belly in. Inhale, release. Exhale, crunch. Inhale, release. Exhale, crunch. Inhale, release. Exhale, crunch. Pull that belly in when you're crunching. Release. Exhale, crunch. And now begin to pulse it. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 2, 1. Now grabbing your f feet and pulling your knees down into your armpits to happy baby or dead bug. Whichever one makes you smile. Inhale. And exhale, pulling your legs further into your arms. Keep breathing. And bringing your knees into your chest. Dropping your ankles by your close into your body. We're going to go up into bridge. Clasp your hands behind you. Coming up on your shoulders. Hips are up. Don't let your knees fall out. Keep them in as close as you can. Pushing your hips up. 
And if you're ready, bring your right leg up in the air. Keep breathing. And dropping it and bringing your left leg up. Keeping your hips up high, opening your chest. Keep breathing. Hips are high, squeezing and releasing back to the mat. One vertebrae at a time. Bring your knees into your chest. Rolling side to side. And we're going to go into wheel. And then we'll go into some relaxation. Bring your feet close in. Hands are above your shoulders. Fingers pointing towards, the, towards your toes. Inhale. And exhale, releasing all the way up. Straightening out your legs if you can here. And slowly releasing, bringing your knees to your chest, dropping your head, rocking side to side, massaging your back. And dropping your legs. Looks like it's time for the most important pose in yoga. Don't leave us yet. This is the moment that we take all to ourselves to enjoy the feeling of warmth in all our muscles. Continue to deep breathe, releasing all those toxins and stress. One more deep inhale through your nose. Exhaling through that straw, slowly. And letting your body take over your breath. Hand, palms are up to the sky. Feet are slightly open. Begin re relaxing your body, starting with your forehead and moving down slowly to your feet. Let your jaw relax. Let your shoulders fall into the mat. Let your tongue fall. Let your cheeks fall. Let your hips open and sink. Resting your knees and your ankles. Feeling your body become limp, sinking into the warm earth. Doing one last mental check over your body, finding any tense muscles, and letting them relax. Empty your mind.
and start to awaken your body, wiggling your fingers and your toes, keeping your eyes closed, reaching your hands above you. One last big stretch. Exhaling, coming to the side into a fetal position. Keeping your eyes closed. When you're ready, you can push yourself into a seated position. You can come into lotus here if you want. Bringing your hands out to your knees, palms are up. Touching your finger, index finger with your thumb, forming a circle. Keeping that energy be energy flowing inside your body. And now bring your hands out to the sides. Feeling that energy in your hands. Start to lift those balls of energy slowly. Until you feel your hands almost come together, holding it a moment, and turning your palms out and pushing it back down, exhaling. Dropping your hands to the mat. And bringing your hands to heart center. Inhale, opening your chest, looking up. Exhale, sinking your chin to your chest. Namaste. Thank you for joining us today. I hope you enjoyed it. Remember to leave us some comments or some feedback.